Oh. Oh my god, what am I doing? I usually guys, I, I usually don't do content warnings on stream. I'm I'm hopefully I always hope that you guys like mature enough to handle some of these games that I play. Um so I don't really like hey, tell you guys, hey, this this game has this this and this and this. So I don't, I don't really do, I go into things blind usually guys, so I just hope you guys are mature enough to handle the, some of this content that I, I play here on stream. That said, I've heard some pretty bad things about this game. Um, so I, I think this game has all the content warnings you could possibly have. Uh, this game is called Martha is Dead, so <laughs> welcome to a game called Martha is Dead. I want I want to know who Martha is and why she died. You know, with a title like that, we better know by the end. Uh, let's start the game. The story of Martha is dead. The game contains potentially uncomfortable scenes. Oh god, guys! See, I told you, I'm warning you, I'm warning you guys. There's uncomfortable scenes and topics in here. You guys got to be mature. All right, we got to we got to put on our big papa pants here. Read this. Lots of physical trauma and self-harm. Yo, big papa pants on tonight, guys. We might be going down. Oh, God, blood, dismemberment. Oh, sweet. I mean, sorry. Oh, that's terrible. Disfigurement of human bodies and self-harm. Oh, disturbing shit, guys. <laughs> oh, God, this is going to be edgy. Oh, this is going to be an edgy fucking game. I'm excited. I'm Julia. Julia K. I'm glad you are here. Oh, thank God I don't have to read. Nobody has visited me in ages. It's been years now. I must tell you my story, but... I don't know where to begin. There is so much that childhood that my memories of these times are vague. I only remember the summer of 1929 when they sent me off to stay with my nanny. 1929 when they sent me off to stay with my nanny. New chapter, the legend summer. Nanny. 1929. Can you tell me the story of the white lady? No, little sparrow. Not tonight. A fog is coming, see? Yes. I know that when it's foggy, the lady kills young women. But why is she so evil? You see, Julia, pain and suffering can make us do evil things. That's right. Even if we're not actually bad. Just like soldiers have to kill other soldiers. I like the lady I've decided now. Is that Golem? She must be. Is that a female Golem? Pain. The poor dear. <coughs> She still scares me a little though. Soon I'll be a young woman. And she could kill me. Does she kill those who love her? Of course not. That makes me feel better because I love her. But what about Martha? Would she be in danger? Your sister is with your mother. So do not worry. Do you miss them? No. I mean, yes. I miss Martha a little. But... I love spending time with you. Now, go to sleep, little sparrow. It's getting late. Okay, nanny. I'll go to sleep and dream of the lady. <laughs> she was beautiful. Yes, very much so. Then she'll be beautiful in my dreams. And will I be beautiful just like her? You'll be <laughs> <laughs> Oh, please. Then I'll sleep. I promise. Oh, all right. You always get your own way. All right. Nanny and I loved that story. Every time I heard it, it sounded like a new and more mesmerizing tale. Every night I would ask her to tell me about it. It's a lot of story in this, guys. Pay attention. And now I can remember every single day of that time and how happy I was. Okay. I can actually play now. Okay. According to an I can look. Legend, I can look around. The lakes of the area. Are okay, I'm the daughter. The spirit of a young woman who was killed by the man she loved. Gazing out at the old tree growing on the lake's island. So much hope and desire that death, not love, was awaiting her. Uh, speak up or keep listening. Um, okay, I'll speak up. Oh, bah. Life isn't fair, Poppet, but that's the way it is. And we must learn to deal with it. Okay. 
I'll try, but it makes me so mad. Keep on reading, Nanny. Confessed he had killed her out of jealousy. This is a terrible book. So he was hanged on the small island. Oh my god. The very same lake where he had killed the girl. Why are we reading this? This is terrible. Searched everywhere, but the girl's body was never found. Her spirit, known as the White Lady, has been imprisoned in the depths of the lake. The White she Lady. She grieves eternally for the loss of the man she loved. It's like a ghost legend story. When fog arises, the White Lady is known to leave the waters of the lake and roam the woods, looking for her long lost love in vain. Within the fog of dawn, hunters have claimed to hear the wailing of a woman in the distance. Um, I'm going to speak up. I'm a little scared of this story, even though I like the lady. Should I stop reading, my little sparrow? Should she stop reading? No, 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 no. Daddy always tells me that fear must be faced. Fear must be faced, Correct. guys. Okay, honey. We will always be afraid of it. And it will fester. Every time the sad memory in your mind perished, stirs Do it. in her soul. She takes the life of a young woman by slaying such a life in its youth. Even just for an instant, the lady feels free from the burden of her pain. Yes, my grace. Yeah. Okay, okay, there's some good backstories, some, some ghost stuff going on, some white ladies and lakes. It's not scary. Spent almost three years with the Holy nanny, crap. when I came home, I quickly forgot how to be happy. My memories did not return until 15 years later, in 1944. I think the game's loading. I stayed in that house. I enjoyed setting up cameras in the woods by the lake. My father created a device that attached to the cameras. It would make them take pictures at set intervals. I was trying to photograph animals, or whatever else was in that damned place. New chapter of the lake. Well, look at that, guys. That chapter was so easy. Now it's 1944 in July. Look, I, I beat chapter one, guys. I'm so good. I'm so fucking good at this game. What am I doing? Oh. Okay, I'm, I'm just standing here by the lake. Uh, I got this old-timey uh, camera, and I'm just gonna go take a picture with it. There we go. S say cheese, Lake. I'm just gonna wind that up. Reel off the film. Uh, okay, I rolled up the film. Now I'm going to open. Open the camera. Open the camera? Why? Remove the old roll of Oh, we're changing the film, guys. Watch this. This is a good learning lesson. Put the new film in. Uh, I'm going to cl close it. There we Change go. The Load the film. Okay. Activate the timer. Activated the timer. So these type of cameras need to expose for a very long time. Now to bring the image into focus. They don't just take a picture and it's done. They need to expose for a very long time. So what you're taking a picture of has to be very still. Which is why when you look at very old pictures, that their smiles are really weird and fake. It's because they had to stay still. And hold that smile. That's why not a lot of people smiled back then, actually. They, they just held a regular smile. Or re a regular facial feature. Because holding a smile for, I don't know how long it was. It was probably over a minute. It was probably too awkward. So they just kind of all just blankly stared in the camera. And held that position for a long time. I gotta focus now. There's something floating on the surface of the water. If I frame it better, I might be able to see what it is. Um, use the move. Okay, we gotta focus. Focus. What am I focusing? Oh, is that a dead body? 
That's, that's a dead body in the lake. What? 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 Is that a person? I must help them. I must. I must help them. I'm coming. I'm going down to. I'm not. I'm not controlling this. I'm just holding the run button for something. There's someone in the lake, guys. Let's go save him. I was horrified at the idea that someone might have drowned in my lake. The lake was my world, where I would spend entire days daydreaming. I would lose myself in my thoughts, but that was a rude awakening. So terrible. So terrible. Oh no, is that Martha? What is that? Oh, oh, I'm getting naked. I'm, I'm jumping in, guys. I'm jumping. I'm going fucking swimming. Let's, let's go. What? What? Oh, hey, guys, don't look. Here we go. Whee! Whee! Whoa, whoa. Okay, we're underwater now. Oh, it's, it's, it's the lady. I'm going to swim towards her. I'm coming. Don't kill me or jump scare me. I'm coming. I'll save you. <gasps> Hello? You dead? I instantly noticed that the person was wearing one of my dresses. I was scared. My dresses? I dragged that lifeless <gasps> body as best as I could to the shore, trying not to drown myself. Only when I lifted my her in my arms did I realize who she was. It was my sister, my twin, a part of me, dead. My twin impossible to comprehend. Sister! I was desperate. I didn't know what to do or to think. Huh. Interesting. I have to stay calm. Stay calm. Um. Martha is not dead. Martha's not dead, guys. She's not dead, no. Possible. No, she, she looks... She, she... She... It's not true. It's, no, it's not true. It's not possible, guys. It's not happening. Martha is not dead. Martha's not dead. Unfortunately, the name of the game is she's dead, it's not so... Possible. She's dead. dead. It's not true. Not true. No? no? There's no pulse. No, she's dead. There's no need to worry. No, yeah. She keep on saying that. Everything is fine. Everything's fine, guys. Whatever you need to do to cope. Everything will be fine. Oh god. Have to stay calm. Th there's a war going on too? Martha is not dead. No, she's not. Okay, what is that? Something by your neck is a, ne a necklace, it's right? Not possible. Martha. Martha, February 26th, 1923. Okay, she's got a dog tag. All right. She's been ID'd. Is Elevir? Okay? Are you hurt? Who's that? No, I'm fine, but uh, she's dead. What are you doing? I didn't kill her. Go, Eric. Run. Run where? My parents ran towards me. Oh, those are parents. My mother hugged me. She, who detested me, was now cuddling me. Ugh. Her warmth filled me with life. And the pain became bearable. I felt protected. Martha, are you okay? She asked me, speaking slowly in order to let me read her lips. She thought I was deaf. She thought I was Martha. I didn't want the moment to fade. So I meekly nodded my head. Oh, she confused her child? I had done something that couldn't be undone. <gasps> she confused them! What? To pretend to be Martha forever. Oh my god, she's gonna be she's gonna pretend to be her sister. Her twin sister. Oh, okay, we got we got a little switcheroo going on here. How could the mother not know? There's always some type of feature in twins that, that differentiate there's something you can tell. Even though when you first meet them they look identical, there's always something. There's always something. Anyways. Oh no! Martha, I'm sorry. I've I've become you and now I'm taking up your life. Oh god. I'm going to I'm going to sign the cross. The Lord who gives life to the dying. Let your sacrifice of love be offered for Martha's soul. Into your hands I also entrust my spirit. 
so that I may be reunited with her in perpetual light, to never suffer the desolation of purgatory. Please grant her eternal rest, O Lord, and may eternal light shine upon her. Amen. Did you remember to light the candles in the hall? People will be here soon. Light the candles? Oh God! Always find something for everyone to do. I gotta light the candles. Oh, I can walk around. Oh, this is the first time I can walk around. Okay, okay, okay. Let's let's just take a look. Let's familiarize familiarize ourselves with this area. Holy crap! There's so much things we can look at. What is this? Daddy's oboe. We were preparing a really nice. What the fuck is an oboe? Oboe. On the rare occasions he's at home. That is. Oh God! What? Oh, he's passed out drunk. This guy's passed out drunk. He's got like. I don't know, wine or something. Got some wine, some cigarettes. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. Books, books, and more books. In our villa, there must be ten times more than even here. Daddy must be devastated. He loves me. I messed up, and now I have to watch him suffer my death. Oh my God! At least light the candles. And let him find some comfort in why go on with this lie why not just tell them i don't get it why does she have the need to carry on the lie yes they she could have just uh the, the more she holds out the more the worse it gets right there's so much shit to look at what is this what am i holding oh it's a lighter oh, oh i light candles with it okay okay here we go my first task as um Martha. Never a moment's peace. Even at a time like this. She can't sit still for a second. <gasps> what the fuck? Oh, for a moment I thought I saw No, no, that's not possible. There must be this whole situation making me see things that don't exist. Everything. Mommy wanted me to do something. I don't know what she wanted me to do, but I'm going to go that way. Okay. You put the flowers down now. Everything always has to be perfect. With here. Oh, over here. Oh, okay. We put them right here. There we go. Okay, flowers go down. Okay. Okay. What's happening? What is yeah. Close the door. Who closed the door? Why? Erich. Erich, wake up. Do you think it's appropriate to sleep here? Of all places. What? Hmm? Yes. I must have fallen asleep. What are they talking about? Oh, we're spying on my parents. You can't stay here forever. Why don't you go to bed? No, no. I want to stay with my daughter. Your daughter? Your daughter? You have another daughter, you know. The one who's still alive. Remember? What are you talking about, Irena? Julia is dead. What kind of comment is that? Let, let the man grieve. You should be thinking about Martha. Julia harmed Martha. You know that, right? And as if that were not enough, she has now also abandoned her. It's the same old story. Oh, what a bitch! Everything is always Julia's fault, isn't it? Her fault for Martha being deaf, and for you being infertile. Do you think it's the right time for this? Julia is dead, Irena. Dead. Someone killed her. Do you realize that? Of course I realize. I get it. Do you think I'm stupid? No one understands it better than me. She always brought problems. Only problems. It would have been better if she hadn't been born at all. <laughs> oh my You're god. Crazy. I'm the crazy one? The mom is me? fucking a witch. She is a fucking wicked witch. Holy shit. They have done this to get at me. Yes. Your death is all my fault. All I could ever do for you was hurt you, Julia. My poor, sweet, crazy girl. What will I do without you? What will life be like now? 
All the time I didn't spend with you. But now I'm home. We can go fishing together. We can take pictures of butterflies. No. We can't do anything together anymore, can we? Nothing. I miss you, Julia. I miss you. No, Julia, no. While American bombings contingent news from the area of La Ramola, the young daughter of German Army General Erich K. was murdered near her home. What possible reason could there have been behind such a cowardly act? This is what the Carabinieri, who immediately intervened, hoped to find out. God, the mom is terrible. The dad the seems to be the good guy, but... ...suffer from the situation. All she cared about was that my death was so painful for Martha. But not having me around anymore must have been a great relief to her. At the end of the day, it was better for everyone that it was me who died. And it was better for me, too, that people thought that. But the guilt began to consume me. That's when I started having horrible nightmares. <gasps> oh, God. Not nightmares. Oh, God. Nightmare sequence. I, Martha. Whoa, oh, I'm going towards Martha. What? What, what am I doing? Uh, Martha has found. Um, no, that's wrong. Okay, uh, I? No, okay, we, okay. It's it's trial and error, guys. Martha has lost uh, her life. Nope, it's Martha has lost her soul. Okay, Martha has lost her. Her soul. Martha. Oh, oh shit. Why? Why'd you have to do this, Martha? Martha, no. I thought that's a cool camera. Oh god, Martha. She looks already dead. This is a nightmare. Martha has lost her soul. Cheese. Martha? Oh god, um, uh, they? No, it's I. This is so fucking weird. I've never played a game like this before. <laughs> this is I. 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 I stole. Uh, I stole her. I stole her. Uh, I identity, right? Yes. I stole her identity. I stole her identity. I stole her identity, guys. What the fuck is going on now? Oh god! That's- that's pretty bloody. I don't- I don't like those- that plucking of the violin. That- that is unsettling noise. Yes, identity theft is a serious crime. Martha, what happened? What happened to you? Oh, fuck! Oh my god, what am I doing? Why am I doing this? Holy shit. Oh, fuck, that's a razor. Oh god. Oh god, I'm controlling this. Can I, can I, can I, can I reverse it? Can I, no, I can't reverse it, guys. I have to do this. I'm... Holy, holy hell balls. Okay, we're just, we're just slicing up with a razor, guys. We're just, we're, I'm gonna borrow her features for a bit. Oh god! No oh, no! Oh god! Oh! Holy fuck! Holy 
Holy fuck. We gotta go down. No! Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> Wow. Whoa. Whoa. <laughs> um. Yeah, let's just put that on our face. Yes. That's how that works. Okay. <laughs> Emotional damage. That horrendous woman and the face of my sister. I wish all of this was a dream and my sister is just sleeping in her bed. Instead, her bed is empty and this is reality. Um, okay. That was probably one of the most gruesome sequences I've seen in a game so far. For level of detail, quality, and disturbingness, that was that was at least top five, guaranteed, right there. Um, I'm I'm curious. You think TikTok will let me post that scene to TikTok, or or, or do you think it'll get taken down? <laughs> um, yes, I warned you guys. This this is uh this is as mature adult game as you could possibly handle right now. Um, what is that? New chapter, the room. All right, guys, I want to show you something. I've been looking at this for the past minute. What the f fuck is with this painting? What is that? An He's holding a knife and there's like a bunch of babies in bed. Scary fairy tales. Oh, they're fairy tales. To be scary lately. Yet everything here is so beautiful and bright. Beautiful and bright? Our beautiful home. In spite of everything, I prefer being here. Martha's clothes. To me, wearing them will be like having her with me. Mummy will also be happy to see them. I'm not. What is this? Oh gosh, if Mummy sees this picture, she'll throw it away for sure. It's me and Lapo. I want to see him as soon as possible so we can mourn Martha's death together. Nanny will be visiting me soon. <gasps> Nanny's coming! Nanny's coming! What's on the door here? Ooh, it's my satchel. Everything I need is always in my bag. Let's, let's, let's dress ourselves. We've got to be very proper tonight. Proper? Proper clothing? I'm already dressed. Oh, I'm already dressed. Oh, how silly. Let's go. What's this? Hey, can I get out of here? Oh, I got a key. I got a key. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take the key. Key to my trinket box. Oh, to my trinket box. Okay. Um... Oh, okay, there we go. Who? My... July 12th, oh. 1944. This is a new diary. My voice. here today and I forgot my old one back at home. But that's okay. A new chapter in my life. A new diary. They say they brought us here for our own safety. Daddy, the war, and everything else. Nanny gave us her house and she went to look after the man. Story time. It's weird being back here after so many years. I remember Nanny telling me the fairy tale of the Lady of the Lake. It's one of the few happy memories I have from when I was little. Nanny isn't here and that's a shame, but Martha is. I also get to see Lapa. Damn it. Often, which is why Mum is thankfully too preoccupied with fixing up the house to worry about me. At least for now. Okay. Um, next page? Holy fuck. July 16th. There is some goddamn stories in this game, guys. Something creepy about the woods. Every time I'm at the lake, I get a strange feeling. Maybe it's the legend of the white lady playing tricks on me. I get weird ideas. I think that there is this presence. Then I think I'm just being crazy. Anyway, crazy or not, I want to take some pictures. I'm not scared. In fact, I'd say I'm excited. I've made arrangements with Martha. She's coming to the lake with me tomorrow to set up two new cameras with timers, and we'll see what we can photograph. Not before a good swim, of course. To be honest, Martha doesn't like photography all that much, and recently she's gone off swimming too. But she does like spending time with me by teasing me. Then, when she gets bored, she disappears into her books, and I do my own thing. We feel right when we're together. Okay. 
little diary thing going on there. Cool. Learning more. I'm just going upstairs to call Martha down for breakfast. Don't. Fine, but I'm not sure we should let her sleep all day. What do you think? What did you say? Okay, okay. I won't wake her up. I'll, I'll just turn on her light. So when she wakes up, she'll know when to come this down. This is near them. I need to be careful not to talk, or I will be in serious trouble. Um, okay. I need to be careful how I talk, or I'm going to be in serious trouble. Okay, be quiet. Um, uh, we, we gotta play the game. The game is afoot. Uh, this door is locked, okay. That's fine. What are we doing? God, everyone smoked back, to, back in the 1940s. I know I would've. I smoked in the 90s. Uh, hold shift. No, I didn't. I did not smoke in the 90s. I smoked in the 2000s. Oh god, I would've been, I would've been in elementary. I mean, nope. Um, okay. Door. It's locked. Strange. Why did they lock my room? They locked my room? Why did they lock my... dead sister's room? Hmm. I wonder why. I guess we're gonna find out. Okay, we're going downstairs. Oh, wow. Martha's breakfast is ready. We can go. Yes, yes. It's getting late. Did you leave the newspaper for Martha? You know how much she likes reading it. Yes, Irena. It's on the table, can't you see? And that camera? Are you leaving it there? Yes, Irena. Can't you leave it there for a few more days? Do you mind? It was for Yulia. We'll take it away soon. I, I promise. The thought makes me so sad. Seeing it there is as if... I don't know how to explain it. All right, all right, all right. But let's go now. We have too much to do. We can't stay here all day talking. Me who will now read the newspaper instead. They'll be out all day. The funeral preparations will take them a long time. Everything is more complex with the war. Over the next few days, I will see little to nothing of them. Yeah, K to see objectives. Oh, I got objectives. Holy crap. Okay, we're getting to we're getting into some gameplay here now, guys. Uh, the frame. Uh, I need to put one of my photos in an empty frame. I need a camera. A camera. Uh, I need a camera. Okay. Left it on the table. Okay, there's a camera on a table somewhere. Oh, right here. Here it is. I'll just grab that. Oh, do I... The, 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 this newspaper has a little exclamation point on it. I think that's very important. I better look at it. Brutal assassination in San Casciano. Julia Kay, a young woman from a respectable family, brutally murdered near her home. Carabinieri investigates. A possible political motive emerges. Martha was not killed by politics or war. She was killed by something much closer and much less clear. Hmm. I will find out the truth. Interesting. Oh my god, we can... Oh my god. This game is so... Brutal assassination deep in San Casciano. With content. Julia Kay, and voice acting. A woman from a respectable family, brutally murdered near her home. Carabinieri investigates. A possible political motive emerges. Okay, I'm, I'm not going to read all this. I'm not going to read all this. I'm not going to do it. I'm just going to grab the camera. We're, we're going we're gonna to get down to business here, guys. We're, we're, I mean business. I can verify that the camera is still working by taking a photo. I could photograph the sparrow. There are so many of them out here. It's watching Nanny as she cooked. I always picked up loads of techniques. We are so lucky. In these difficult times, pantries are empty and people are going hungry. But with a German general for a father, food is never scarce. Uh, I think we're going this way. They're planning the funeral, so I guess she hangs out there until then. Okay. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Let's, let's um... Let's turn, let's turn this up a bit. Oh my god. I don't know what, I don't know what game engine this is, but... It's pretty fucking... purty. 
Oh my god, there's animals. Oh, there's freaking animals down there. It's a cow. It's a cow. And some lambs. Goats? Lambs? Goats. I, 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 I'm breathtaking right now, guys. I'm breathtaking. Move. Oh, is that, is that a little birdie? Oh, I can take a picture. I can take a picture. How do I take a picture? I take a picture of the birdie. All right. Um, gotta use that camera. Gotta line up my shot here. I'm about to take my first picture. Here we go. Watch this, guys. Uh, change the R, R and F height. Okay. Yeah. No, that, that. I'm gonna go like this. Yeah, I'm gonna like, I'm gonna go down. Um, inc incline. Oh, oh. Oh, we can do like a little um, sideways shot. No, 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 that's not cool. It's not cool. Let's go like that. And then um, bro rotation. Okay. Uh, subject framed out of focus. How do we focus? Oh, okay. Holy fuck, this is intricate. Okay. Oh, this is exposure. Okay, okay, okay. Do -do 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 aperture. It actually tells you. Okay, now 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 I'm pulling focus. It tells you if it's a focus or not. So that seems good enough there. <laughs> Properly exposed uh, subjects in frame, and now I can close the panel. Oh, whoops! And then press space to shoot. Out of focus is not highlighted. Oh, it's in. Oh. Even though it's not out of, even though it's not highlighted, it, it is out of focus. Okay. I see that now. There we go. Okay. Properly exposed. Blah, 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 blah. Take a picture. Excellent. I've taken the picture. Now it's straight to the dark room in the cellar to print it. There we go. Daddy recently became First picture done. The German army. He used to take pictures. Whoa. Of lines. Whoa. Now he gives me the material Whoa. to take photographs instead. Martha is gone. Only this camera can fix my ideas and my memories. I can't allow myself to forget. Uh, develop the, the photo in, in the dark room. Oh, we gotta go to the cellar? In the dark room. Ooh. Ooh, quack, quack, quack. Can you run in this game? Yes, you can run. I am, yes. Quack. Quack. Okay, we're going into the dark room. Oh, it's spooky down here. It's spooky. It's... These could be of use to me. Oh. Yeah, we'll just take those massive scissors. Mummy's sewing machine. She learned how to sew because nobody else could do it to her liking. Okay, she learned how to sew. Mummy's medicine. Will they do her any good? What is mummy's medicine? Not sure. Whoa, 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 whoa. That, that's not blood, guys. That's not blood. That's, that's just wine. Some wine broke, okay? That may look like someone's trying to clean up a bloody mess, but the wine is actually pretty red. Daddy is so proud of it. This is like a, a winery after, after all. We're going into our dark room. We're going to go develop some photos. Daddy set up his dark room here. He doesn't take photos anymore, but I'm allowed to use the dark room when I want to. Okay. Red rum. Okay, let's develop some photos, guys. Photos must be developed in a dark room. Three baths when developing photos. The development bath, then the first rinse, and then the fixing bath. The second rinse is done directly in the sink afterwards. Okay. Are we going to actually like fully on learn how to develop film? Because that was kind of interesting. I want to develop some 8mm film. Film, film reels. Uh, develop a photo. First, you have to use the uh, larger. The larger is an optical instrument that allows you to process photographic paper. After shooting the photo, the film must be developed in several steps. This aspect has been omitted for the sake of simplicity, but in reality, the steps are as follows. The film is firstly rolled on a reel and you must put it inside a small tank. The tank is then immersed in developer, washed, and then immersed in a soft stop bath. Stop bath. Okay, then it's washed again, dried, and finally cut. 
you will find your rolls of film already developed and ready for printing. Choose the image you want to, to print on the paper. Okay. I want to do... I want to do the pretty birdie, the, the last one I took. The last one. Develop that one. Enlarger allows you to customize your photos even more. You can choose which part of the paper to, the picture will be printed, and you can adjust the focus and choose how long exposed about a little, little, little red filter. Use the controls. Okay, we'll figure it out as we go on. Let, let's... I don't need no tutorial. Here we go. Oh, oh, we can we can move things. Okay. Uh, we can also enlarge it. Oh, 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 shit. Okay, I want to I go full in. Full, full right in focus right in the middle there, that bird. And then adjust focus. Oh, okay. Okay, we're, we're in focus. Okay. Now we can expose it. Here we go. I can't develop the photo like this. Why the fuck not? Card out of position? She says it's out of position. It's right above my hair. Expose. When the red filter is removed, the image will be exposed onto the paper. This process has been automated and made faster than what it happens in real life. Okay. So we're not really learning how this process works 100%. This is kind of like video gameized. If that's a word, I don't know. Stop quacking. You bought this game, Anna, really? It's, it's, uh, is it up your alley? Immerse the paper in developer and the image will appear. To achieve ex ideal exposure, the paper out of the developer when the timer is in the green zone. You'll take the paper out too early or too late. The paper, the paper will be ruined. Oh god. Okay, we got to keep it in the green zone. Let's try to do that. Here we go. Um. Okay, I just got to stop it at the right time. Uh, the meter's going down. Don't want to develop it for too long. In real life, immersion in developer is followed by a wash, a stop bath, and a second wash. These additional baths have been skipped for the sake of simplicity. I like how it tells you, like, hey, this is how you really do it, but we're not doing it that way because this is a game and I don't want your ADHD to get too high and make you stop playing. So we're just going to make it a little faster. Because, <coughs> guys, real life is boring. Not a bad photograph. It seems that the camera works perfectly. Now I can take a self-timed photo for Martha's frame. Okay. Here's your printed photo. You can keep it in your album or scrap it. You can print each shot as many times as you like. All shots remain available to print at any time. Okay. Put it in my... I'm gonna... I wanna keep this for later. That, that, that's, a, that's a work of art. I'm gonna put that in my album, guys. Yeah. I'm gonna stick that in my pocket. Daddy had this device brought here last week. It's old, but still works. He has always loved everything technological. Uh, there's some... Oh, there's a tripod right there. That's, that's a tripod. Camera is set up. It is. These workbenches fascinate me. I would love to learn carpentry. My dolls. <coughs> the puppets I used to play with were <coughs> made here. Soft. I never knew that when I was a child. They always told me that a fairy brought them. A fairy. I didn't really believe them, but it was nice to think that. Okay. I'm going to sit on the chair, take a self-portrait. I'm going to start the timer here and say, cheese, guys, I want everyone smiling. Say, cheese. Oh, I'm, I'm going to do a sulky. Okay. Okay, there we go. There we go. We took a cell port. I'm going to take the film. Or the camera. No, I took the film. Okay. Let's go develop it, guys. We we are photographers today. I need to know what's on that film. I need to know what I look like. Maybe. It's always a thrill to develop <laughs> a photo. You can't see anything at first, yet something invisible, a black film. A kind of ghost. That invisible breath then returns to reveal the reality from which it was torn. There are those who say that photography steals the soul or captures it. That's why they used to photograph ah. the dead. But so these are camera negatives, negatives, guys, and you got to develop the, 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 the negative, right? Okay, here we go. Uh, she's going to get put her in... Okay, she's out of position. Out of position. So we're going to align that? No. Yes. But I have to do it secretly. Okay, that's a good... That's a good position right there. We're out of focus. Okay, now we're in focus. And then we're going to... Expose it. 
exposed the picture. And then we're going to develop it with chemicals. Yes, this is me. No one was ever able to tell us apart. But I never had the slightest doubt, and nor did Martha. It's strange how what identifies us most deeply is not visible to anyone. Good picture, good picture! The memory of that day at the lake was becoming more and more like a dream when, after awakening, the image becomes more and more faded. Could it be that the memories were a figment of the mind? Had I been the one that hurt my sister, I had always envied her and now I had taken her identity. I experienced a suffocating pattern of thoughts. I decided to go straight to the lake to retrieve the film rolls. They would tell a different story, I was sure. But deep down, I kept hoping they would confirm my fading memory. Of course the door is locked. The keys aren't hanging on the lock as usual, then they will be in Daddy's study. We live in fear now. My parents are not going to let me go to the lake anymore after Martha's death. So this is the right time. I need to know. The self-doubt I feel is eating me up. New chapter, the rolls. The same day at 11.30 p.m. Okay, we're, it's dark out. It's scary. We're, we need to get some camera. Okay, I left my camera by the lake. I should go get them and they could be important. Uh, the door, I need a key. I need to find a key. It should be in dad's study located below their bedroom. Okay, oh, I'm looking for things. Oh, there's a key. Found it. No? Okay, good. The forest is very dark. The lighter will not be enough. <coughs> Better to use the gas lamp. Okay. We need a gas lamp. Have a good sweep. Oh, there it is. Oh, it's right there. Okay. Got it. Got it. Ooh, that, that's... That's a kerosene lantern. Cool. Okay. Back in my day... Our flashlights were had to have gas in them. That's right. That's right, kids. Our flashlights were combustible. Arr. Fucking kids. Get off my lawn. Hey, you fucker. You little fuck. Let me teach you a thing or two about respecting your elders. Okay, guys. We got this. This is actually kind of cool. Old school kerosene lamps and stuff. That is fun. And it's actually look at look at the bugs around the light. How realistic? How realistic is that? What? What the fuck? This fucking forest. It's it's fucking spooky in here. My fucking cabbages. You cabbages, you fucking kids! Oh my god, get off my get off my lawn, you! The night, but this night scares me. I it's love dark. I can feel all the harm I've caused. It's getting closer with each step. I feel it brushing up against me like a cold wind. I hurt Martha. The closer I get to the lake, the more certain I am of this. How could it not be? I killed her to steal the love that everyone felt for her, but didn't feel for me. How could I have done such a thing? The guilt is closing in on me. Back about the ride, we're just gonna walk down this dark forest. Dark, dark and spooky forest. With my kerosene lantern. We got a fork in the road. I'm gonna consult my map because I have no freaking clue. Uh, we're gonna go left. Yes, left makes sense. Let's go this way. I'm just gonna walk slowly. Let the nice ambience of this forest uh, engulf over me. I don't speak English. God, this game looks so nice. I don't. I don't think this. Oh, Ooh, there's a spooky ghost. 
guys who spooped? There was a spoopy ghost. I think that was Martha. Yo, yo, Ma whoa. Fucking, oh my god, that duck. That duck almost made me jump. Stop quacking. Where are you, Martha? Martha? Spoopy. Spoopy Martha. Oh, do we have to do the duck thing? Oh, ooh, a picture. It's picture time, guys. Look, it's old World War II helmet. I'm gonna take a nice picture of that. I'm just gonna... It's too dark. I need to, um... Crank up that exposure. There we go. That looks good. Okay. Wait, wait. Okay, there's a the helmet. Uh, subjects in frame. It's too dark. Okay, I'm gonna need... I'm gonna need a light or something. Flash photography. I need a flash. That's definitely right. Yes. She said I, I had one. Where is it? Don't worry. No, nothing's gonna... Nothing pops out at you when you... When you backtrack. So we're, we're, we're fairly safe if I'm going the correct way home. I don't know. Do, 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 do. Why? Why? Cheese. I need, I need the stress. The cheese. Oh no. Damn lamp. Luckily I still have my lighter with me. Well, I gotta light the lamp again. Oh, what the fuck? Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Th things happen. Things happen. This is Martha. Things happen when... Okay, uh, okay. Uh, that, that's why. I went, I went the wrong way. I went the wrong way. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Am I going the right way? Martha? 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 Hey, Martha, get off my fucking lawn, you crazy lady! Hi, you fucking ghosts! Don't know no fucking respect these days! Fuck. Oh, 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 the camera. Oh, okay. Do I take a picture? Say cheese. I need a flash. It's too dark. Oh wait. Why am I taking two cameras left? Why am I picking up all the cameras? Is this is this like ghost adventures? I'm like taking pictures at night and shit and trying to capture ghosts. What's that light up over there? You guys see those lights up there? For the film, okay. I'm making a film. That's not the big dipper. Okay. Oh, I found another camera. Aliens. Aliens. One more. Camera, another camera. I didn't say it was aliens. Shred of fabric here in the woods. But it was aliens. How strange. Let's take a photo of it and leave it where it is. That's oh. It. I've got them all. These oh. films are going to help me understand what happened. Now oh. I should rush home to develop them. No, it's, t it's telling me to, to go develop them. And take a photo of Martha. Find the camera flash. Okay. We, we, got, we, got, we got to go develop the film. That's what we're doing. That's what we're doing. Uh, I got my flashlight here. We're going back, guys. Martha's coming. But we got we to gotta, we gotta get a picture of Martha. The ghost Martha with, with our flash. This, this, is it just me or this light? Is this light more darker than it was? Oh fuck! Oh god! Martha! Martha! What do we do? Oh god, leave me alone! Martha? Yeah, run! Run! Run back home! Run! Run! Oh god, I'm just running! I'm controlling where she's going! Oh god, can I look at the map? Oh, I got a duck! I can't stop running, the game is forcing me to run. Uh, I don't know which way to go. But we're just gonna keep on running. Space! Jump! Hurdles! Drugs are bad, okay? <laughs> okay. Oh god, where the fuck am I? I'm in the trenches. Oh fuck, where the hell did I end up? Do I have to go this way? I don't want to go that way. I'm going this way. Fuck this. Oh, okay. Nope, nope. Game has forced me to go this way. Alright, I can't leave, guys. Well, that's a big skull. Ooh, um, okay. Um, hello? I bet you someone nice lives here. You know? This has got the nice decoration. They must love Halloween, right? Come on. 
Let's not think the worst here. Oh! This is my house, okay. I live here. Uh, Martha? Why am I small? Oh, I'm a child! Oh, I'm a child now! Okay, this is like a, a flashback. Or something. I don't know, it's a nightmare. This is a nightmare. Martha, are you there? Oh, it's that creepy spider noise. Holy fucking textures, Batman. Oh my god. What is happening? Did, did I hang myself? Oh, the fog. Is that fog? Oh god, the maggots! The details! And... Oh god, what the fuck is... Am I looking... <laughs> Guys, we're mature here, no laughing. What the? What the fuck? What's, there's a baby inside Martha? Was Martha pregnant when she died? Wait, I don't get it. Is this, or is this, or is this just a lot of symbolism? Of something. Emotional damage! There's, there's emotional damage going on right now. Um. Hello? Oh, yet another nightmare. Oh, God. She entered my dreams once more. She entered my dreams. She wants to talk to me. What's why is my what am I saying? bed bloody? Fairy tales coming true. Yet I feel no, no. These are the thoughts of a crazy person, and I'm not crazy. Oh god, I got a bloody, bloody bed. Oh, ew. that's bloody. Um, that's a that's a lot of blood. Oh, damn it! What's all this blood? I'm not due yet, and there's a lot more than usual. Yeah, it's okay, so it's me. not a period, but okay. I'm going to be joining Martha sooner than I thought. Then what is that? up and do what needs to be done. If I'm sick, I have little time. The okay, we're sick. Me. It must be hidden within those rolls. That's, that's concerning. I would call a doctor for that one. Um, ch new chapter, The Woods, three days after Martha's death. 10.30 a.m. Uh, into Martha's clothing. You guys okay? You guys okay? Did you guys did you guys handle that? Could you guys handle that? I, I warned you guys. I would stain my clothes with blood. Wait, I gotta wash myself. How do I wash myself? How how did they wash themselves in the 1940s, guys? I don't know. Oh, here we go. Oh, it's, it's a bathtub. Okay, bathtub. No? Uh whatever this is. That's a bidet. Okay. Alright, we're dropping drawers. Cleaning our um our under areas with the bidet. That's better. That's better. There we go. I still don't understand all of that blood. That's never happened to me before. But I'm mm. not going to tell my doctor. Otherwise, he'll make me stay in bed and rest. Okay. Don't. Yeah. Don't tell the doctor. You'll because you can, he'll make you rest. All right. All right. All right. Yeah, I'm happy about that one. Okay. Here's some camera. I found, okay. I got my bag. My bag of cameras. Cool. That was an objective. Now let's go downstairs. And call Grandma. Hello, it's Grandma. Very rude, but I could pick up the phone and listen How to their conversation. I'm worried, Father. Very worried. We found more partisan tracks in the woods, right next to the house. That Lapo. I suspect he may be involved in the death of... No, please don't say that. It's, it's not possible. I know the boy and I don't... Father, anything is possible in these dark times. Anything. Anything's possible. That boy didn't even come to say goodbye to Julia. Didn't they love each other dearly? He must be terribly scared, and Julia always used to... Am I eavesdropping? Yeah, sure, she used to say they were just friends, but you know too, right? Friends are not supposed to do such things, Father. Or are they? But anyway, you're defending them both. You, my husband, and even the nanny who, deep down, is a good woman. The nanny? I believe the nanny is the one who hurt Julia. <gasps> the With nanny. Evil passion for those cards. They are cursed things.
Things. The nanny's sus. I hope you made them disappear. Of course. Is she doing like the tarot cards? My room. Anyway, you must forgive me, Father. I have to go. They've come to pick me up. Have a good day. You too. Lapo's involved in Martha's death. Lapo. My mother is losing her mind again. It's a great friend, but but most importantly, take them from me. <laughs> With my cup of coffee in the morning. Okay, I'm gonna take a picture of Martha here. Okay, Martha. Martha's dead. Guys, Martha's dead. D did you guys know that? I just found out. She's framed. She's out of focus, though. So. Now she's in focus and she's properly exposed. Okay, picture time. It would be nice to have you always by my side, even if it's just a picture. I'm gonna take 25 the 25 ISO film. When the sun is high in the sky, it's perfect. Okay, now we're learning about ISO. With their Shermans. Again, I feel like these pills do nothing other than agitate her. Romola, 15th of July, 1944. Dear Mrs. Irene, I'm writing to let you know that all is well here at the villa. Not Irene. Thank you for being so considerate and caring. Irene? I apologize for the simplicity of the housing you were forced to live in. I also locked the room where the little one used to stay as requested. I've left you the key. It is the one with the pink key ring. Try to stay safe. Best regards, Nanny. Hughes. We have that door locked. It was my room. What is she trying to hide? It's my room, Mommy. I need the key. Where did Mommy put my key for my room? <gasps> Guys, there's Jesus. Dear and, mother. and a note. This is hard, but I have something to tell you. I found out that Julia is pregnant. <gasps> Go to the lake tomorrow morning at seven and watch her as she bathes. You'll see that her tummy is growing. Martha. What? I'm not pregnant. Why is everything becoming even more confusing? I'm searching for an explanation, but instead I'm left with more questions. They thought I was pregnant? So that was the baby in the um, nightmare that we had. So I am I pregnant? Mommy thinks I'm pregnant, but I'm not. I said I'm not. So obviously, I'll be, I'll believe myself because I, I would know, right? Because, you know, you, you, you would know those things, right? Let, let's, let's expose some film. Huh? What's this? Oh, is that a lens? A lens and a roll of infrared Oh, perfect. Film. Infrared film? What the naked eye cannot see. Oh, now we're like taking I have different spectrums of photos. photos. What's over this over here? Oh. With this lens, I can shoot very close up. Okay, Ma a macro lens. Red filter for super high contrast photos. Okay. Orange filter. When there's Orange. Fog, it improves the image by giving it some contrast. Okay, foggy pictures. I use orange. Okay. Blue filter. Ideal for indoor photos. Blue? Why is blue good for indoor? This lens increases the framed area. It allows me to fit more into the image. Okay, so, so like a wide-angle lens. With this lens, everything gets bigger. Hmm. That one must be, um... I don't know. Let's, let's look at this. Keep the volume down as I listen. I must go unnoticed. I am meant to be deaf after all. Ready? Julia? You ready? Sure, Daddy. I'm good to start. I've already started recording. Oh, no, my voice will sound awful. No way, come on. Didn't you want to study singing anyway? No, no, no. I was young and stupid when I said that. Okay. Ready? Go. Oh, how nice. It's the rehearsal for long. But I was right. My voice is awful singing. Anyway, it's time I develop these film roles. I can't wait any longer. I wish I could just stop time. I cannot bear the fact that I may have hurt Martha. I would rather die. Damn my head and these memory lapses. It's such a pain not remembering. It's like getting lost inside yourself. Choose a photo I want to develop. Uh, fuck, I don't. I don't. I don't. Oh, 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 okay. Oh, okay. There, oh, let's, let's develop this one. 
Nice picture of dead Martha. Okay, let's uh get that card in position. There we go. That's nice. Uh, we're out of focus. We're now in focus. The photograph is both the present and the past, like a dead body. I don't know what I'm expecting. Maybe it's silly to think you can capture the soul of someone who has died. Okay, we, we're developing. Get ready, get ready to take it out, guys. Get ready. Right? Right? Now! Her face can't tell me anything anymore. I know that, really. Her lack of expression scares me. I don't even know whether to keep this blank photo with me or just throw it away. I would not keep that and remember her that alive dead i'll put it in the album though <laughs> okay uh next photo choose a photo guys we want to develop a photo of oh god there's a lot of photos here what is this that is not a good photo that looks a little sus. I'm going to develop this one. It looks like someone killing Martha. I'm carrying Martha to shore. I'm trying to save her. My memories, although fuzzy, do match reality. I feel a little better. Now I can find out who really hurt Martha. Maybe I should meet with the white lady. She might be able to tell me something. I need to see Is the white lady. Crazy talk? Yes, definitely. But what's normal about any of this? Nothing's Maybe normal. Have to be a little crazy to get anything done. So let's do the one running into the water. That's that seems like a good one to develop. There's some pretty music going on now. No. Dressed and I'm about to dive in. This matches my memory. Okay, another photo. Yay. Pay attention, pay attention. There we go. Here I was running toward the pier, just as I remember. Okay, put that in album. I'm gonna store that for later. All right, so that must have been, um, I developed all the roles. Good, good. Okay, that's all done. Newspaper, read the newspaper. No, happy room, find keys. <gasps> the letter, okay, the letter Nanny does not say where she left the keys. They had a pink key ring attached to them. Okay, we're looking for uh, keys that have a pink key ring. Okay, things to do. I found a note among mommy's things. It's Martha's handwriting, but I couldn't make sense. Uh, white lady, okay. The, t the tarot cards. I need to find the tarot cards. The tarot cards must be hidden, but who knows where I should, I should, I could start looking in my parents' bedroom. Okay, going into the parents' bedroom. I'm looking for tarot cards now. <gasps> I found the tarot cards. Future was always good for everyone. Maybe when she read them, she saw my true future, which she hid from me. Or more likely, these cards are actually just a stupid game to reassure and deceive oneself with. But deceiving oneself is sometimes necessary. How can we live happily otherwise? 